Well, the one is the one I've mentioned, which is the basic one, that God is love in the first letter of John. That's the most important scriptural citation. Another one, though, is Jesus at the end of Matthew's Gospel, Matthew 28, when he commissions the disciples. Go and preach to all nations. Baptize them in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Also, whenever Jesus declares that he himself is speaking and acting in the very person of God, that's a Trinitarian claim, because the one who sent is himself God. I think those are places to look within the Scripture itself for the doctrine. Though it's true to say the explicit doctrine of the Trinity emerges after the Scripture as the Church reflects upon Revelation. 